right? It's SDC T20 Community Cricket. And again, we have had a very interesting match here this morning. Uh, we had the Granville Cricket Club going up against the Salt Marsh Challengers. And I must say that Salt Marsh qualified for the Super 8s by being the best loser in the, in the knockout round. And so they came in, if we would say, as underdogs. Um, but you know, today, Granville, they, I don't think they played their best game today. And so Salt Marsh capitalized on that. And so Salt Marsh emerged victors. We're going to be speaking with both captains at this time. And so I would like to speak with the Granville captain just to get a feel of what it was like coming into today's match, what it is that their game plan was, and how it is they're feeling at this point coming to the end of this match, going into two other matches in the Super 8 round, what their plan will be. So, um, Captain Finroy Dell of the Granville team, what was your game plan coming in today's game? And, you know, what is it that your game plan worked or did something go wrong? Just tell us what, what was it for you today and your team? Well, the only thing that we to today was that we won the toss and we wanted to bat from we got here. So we won the toss, decided to bat, but 90 runs in a game, here's the way you deserve to win. So we the better team, the better team today, so they won. All right, thank you very much. And as he said, Salt Marsh was the better team. And those teams that are to come, Captain Dell said, guess what? 90 runs is nothing to win a match. So if you want to win the match, you have to go over 90. All right? So, Captain Dell, just another question. Going into the other two matches, what do you think your game plan is going to be? Uh, we are not, I don't think we are going to discuss that. All right, he doesn't want to discuss that and I would agree with you. So, thank you, Captain Dell, for that. We will now be speaking with the captain of the Salt Marsh team, Joseph Lemmy. And so, he went out there and he was contesting the way he was out earlier. But Joseph Lemmy, captain of Salt Marsh, you came into this game as the underdogs. Persons were saying, where is Salt Marsh going? Do, does Salt Marsh have the metal? Do they have the wherewithal? Do they have the power to do this? You went up against Masters. You made a whopping 161, but you lost by 10 runs. And so you were left hanging in the balance, wondering, will we make it into the Super 8? I want you to tell me, um, Captain, what was the feeling like when Salt Marsh learned that they advanced to the Super 8 and what was the plan coming into this game today? Okay, let me say congratulations to my team. We played a very good game. But um, as it relates to when we realized that we were actually true to the Super 8, it was, trust me, it was, it was a very good feeling for all the players, you understand? We were looking for this for a long time and we get the opportunity now to prove our exploit and stuff and we came out today and we did our best okay and so your best was good enough and so the salt marsh team they were able to amass their 94 runs in some 15 point something overs and so it's good that you came out you you stuck to your game plan and you know you did what was needed to be done to win and as the captain of Granville said 90 runs is no runs to win a match so if you came out and lost that means it would have been no team to win a match but it is good that you came and you gave your best and you won the match uh, maybe you don't want to discuss the game plan going forward but how far do you see your team going in this competition well, we all know that the ball is round and anything can happen on any day. We normally say that we don't play cricket in our mind, we play it on the field. And based on the crop of play I have right now, I believe that if we pull our resources together, our efforts together, we will be victorious in the competition. And that is where our efforts are being directed. All right, well spoken by the captain. So the captain is saying that, you know, once you play the game right on the field, you will emerge champions. And so Salt Marsh is looking to be crowned SDC T20 Community Champions for 2021. All right, so there we have it. Thank you for supporting the SDC T20 Community Cricket Competition. And so we thank you as always for watching us, for sharing the link, for telling somebody about us, SDC, and about Jamaica Street Sports. They are on YouTube, they are on Facebook, Facebook, they are on Twitter, Instagram, any social media, you can find them. So, Master Controller, it's over to you.
Thank you for watching Jamaica Street Sports. Please remember to like, share, comment, and subscribe to our YouTube channel, Jamaica Street Sports. And don't forget the notification bell so you will be notified every time we upload a new video.